scale model of uh, NASA's Mars rover. The opportunity is on display here in Bengaluru and it gives a glimpse of uh, the Mars rover and its features and uh, what it has managed to discover on the red planet. Remember, the rover Opportunity has made some significant discoveries during its uh, time on Mars. The rover landed on the red planet somewhere uh, in 2004 and uh, although it was designed for uh, around 90 days period, uh, NASA believed that it would be operational for 90 days period. That's what it was designed for, but it beat all odds and expectations and was operational till 2018. And uh, remember, during its time on Mars, uh, the rover uh, weathered dust storms, solar flares, uh, cosmic rays, and other challenges on the hostile terrain of uh, the planet Mars. It's also made some significant discoveries, like evidence of uh, previous existence of water on Mars, and it also proved uh, if conditions were suitable to sustain microbial life. Now, uh, this real-life model on display here in Bengaluru, NASA, hoping that this will inspire young minds to take up further research uh, around space and uh, other planets in space. And remember, there is uh, Gaganyaan as well that uh, the ISRO is planning and uh, all these agencies hoping that yes, this real-life model will inspire young minds here in uh, Karnataka and in India. Joining us right now, Mr. Shankaran, the director of your Rao Space Center, sir. Uh, a lot of uh, eyeballs focused on ISRO. Uh, any update on Chandrayaan, sir? A lot of work happening, we do understand. As already has been reported in the media, Chandrayaan 3 has already reached the uh, launch port. The preparation is going on there at uh, Sri Harikota. And we do expect that uh, sometime in July, the launch can take place. Mm. So there is update on uh, Chandrayaan 3. So any, any uh, specific things being looked into considering the past, what's happened with the first two? Uh, any area of uh, focus, special focus or caution? Uh, every aspect of the mission has been looked at, particularly from the experience that has happened during Chandrayaan 2. And all possible precautions uh, are being taken or have been taken. And uh, uh, the mood at uh, ISRO is both uh, a bit as well as apprehensive. Okay, sir. Obviously, the next focus would be Gaganyan. A lot of work happening behind scenes. Uh, it's probably something that ISRO is putting in a lot of effort into. As you rightly mentioned, needs a lot of work too. So, any update on that, sir, where it stands today? Gaganyan, as you know, uh, is a very, very intense uh, with a lot of um, new developments, activities uh, to take place. So, uh, many developments and many tests are happening for Gaganyan, which uh, is not visible to public. That is why this uh, question is coming. A lot of work is uh, going on and uh, we do expect uh, there will be something which will be visible to people during this year. So you are saying by the end of the year there will be something significant there that will people be, yeah. There will be something which will, people will be, yeah, newsworthy is going to come. So okay. Thanks a lot sir, thank you for speaking to CNN My News pleasure. 8. With camera person Riyas, Harish Padya for CNN News 18.